Behind the white lines in three, two, one, go. Welcome to match 98. We have robots moving forward, scoring high as we see Sparky make an attempt for the balance, as does the Wolverines. We have one balance charge station, Sparky trying to correct, and they do two level charge stations here on Milstein. Team 90, 76, the Velasa Raptors lining up for a cube. They are one of our wonderful rookie teams here on this division. They have grabbed a couple extra cubes to boot them and Naruma, the Robo Rebels. Team 597, the Wolverines running across the charge station, trying to use that as a way to bypass any traffic jams on the side, scoring up onto a upper cone node. 1690, your Wayland Wildcats placing a cone up high as well. Blue Alliance up by one link to Red Alliance is zero. Team 384 with their cone, that is Sparky going for the upper level. Looks like we may have a complete upper level on blue here pretty soon. Red Alliance on the other hand, working on the bottom and the top. Little bit of a traffic jam there in the blue human player station. Teams communicating behind the wall to make sure they resolve any of those issues. 6090 from Wayland, Michigan driving across the field using their optimized intake for cones. Having the parallel rollers as they do means that they can securely hold the cones while also intaking it into that claw. Little bit of interference here on the field, 9076 and the Rattlers. 597 and 9076 running into each other, of course, with the crisscrossing paths. We have seen a lot of that today. That was your 32nd warning here on the field. 384 looking to complete another row for the Blue Alliance. 15 seconds left in the match. Time to climb as Red Alliance does. Naruma off to the side, ready for their Alliance members to pull up onto the charge station. Red Alliance with the balance charge station. Blue, one robot and two robots. That is a double on blue and a triple on red. Your final determination, as always, is coming up next. 48 to 138, those grid points making the difference.